Hello to all my lively ladies. You're very welcome to today's low impact energetic indoor walking workout. Okay, let's get moving before we begin our workout today. We'll get ourselves warmed up. So crisscrossing in front, tap out the floor, you can move across the room if you want, or you can stay on the spot if you prefer. Sit nice big moves there with the arms. And we have two rounds today. So first of all, we're doing our 30 30 sequence, so that's 30 for the walk, 30 for our following move, and we are going to do 11 exercises and repeating them for two rounds. So don't worry if you don't get it. Round one, any of the moves, you have a second chance there to get it down. Let's do four here, three, two, and one. Nice little quick march. Pump those arms by your side. Now let's go forward and back and forward and back that's it keep going and back two more forward and then back hold your spot now hold your place here make the move nice and big draw those knees up crisscross the arms that's it pull those elbows back for me good work Go over the head there if you want to increase that heart rate a little bit more. And up and down. Let's do two more. And last one. Okay, keep the legs going. Now we're going to open them nice and wide into a straddle and then close that's it and open and close so we'll get those inner and outer thighs nice and warm for today that's it good and close last two and last one now bring the feet together Nice big rainbow legs for me here. We'll continue on warming up those inner thighs. And open and open. That's it, good work. Let's do four and three, two, last one. Now let's punch out that ceiling now. Really drive that palm right up to the ceiling there. Push it up. Feel a lovely stretch now in the torso. And four, three. Now we're going to take it out to the front. Last one out to the front here. Sweep across your body. Nice big move there, right across. Good work. And last four and three, two, and one. Now hold the legs about shoulder distance. Little seat and big circles. Lovely big circumduction, lovely freedom for the shoulder. Feeling that blood circulating around to all those little muscles. That's it, keep the chest upright for me. Now other way, keep the legs doing the same thing and the chest stays upright. It. nice big circles last four and three and two and last one okay we're ready to get going little stationary walks before we begin watch me in the 30 seconds I'll show you the following move that's coming up add weights if you want to if you're having a lethargic day but you'd like to move keep a body weight okay Lovely, feeling a nice, nice bit of stretching going on there in the feet. So we'll start off with our walks, and of course, you don't have to just walk or march. You can add in some jump rope, you can add in some light little jogs on the spot, full out runs, whatever you want to there. Good work. Okay, let's get started. Now we're starting straight away now. Here we go. Right, let's walk it out. So you march away there and let me show you the first move. 
Okay, so it's a low jack for two. Then we're gonna march across the room or you can shuffle it, whatever you like there. And then just keep repeating it side to side. Okay, let me just get some walks in with you here. That's it, and remember you can jump rope it here or jog it on the spot. You don't have to leave it at walking. Okay, let's go. One, two, little shuffler step, and other side for two. One, two, shuffle across. One, two, and one, and two. You can keep the jump jacks nice and light by keeping the arms out to the side if you want to. It doesn't have to be up over the head. One, and two and one and two okay walking it again now next one starting on the right leg step touch one and two you keep walking there and three knee raise i'll show you that again one and two count the foot as it comes in three and then knee raise okay other leg is after the neck the following walk okay so just stick to one side big marches here okay let's go with this one ready and one and two and three and knee one and two you can bring in the arms there if you like and knee oops one let's do that again two and three other knees sorry i have a mistake there and two and three now this knee opposite leg one need to concentrate on this one and three and opposite knee okay the other side will be after this walk or jump rope that's it get that heart rate up a little bit more nice and light up on the toes we'll get ready for that left leg to come in three times and then right leg will be the knee raise don't worry if you mess it up it's okay we'll get it with two rounds of it today let's go one and two and three and knee one it's a lovely move once you get confident confident with it it's really really nice exercise and two and three and knee one and two and three and knee one and two and three and knee well done okay let's jog again now this time you can continue on once we're finished the walk here or jogging or running whatever you like here we're going to just keep it at a little jog and we're going to reach up and down up and down okay arch it out here if you need to now keep that head up nice and high come on we can do it well done okay now keep it at your little jog or march it if you want reach up reach down okay whatever you want here i like the fast feet i think it works nice with the fast arms punch out the ceiling punch the floor and down come on we can do it keep going back to our walks jump ropes jog next well done okay let's walk up a steep incline next one now we've got we've heel taps and you can stay with just tapping out the heel if you want to if you want to make it harder punch out the ceiling okay so those high arms above the head will make it challenging for you keep going here now i think i was doing my nice big steep incline reach and up and up up and up well done yields punch out the ceiling this is tough now this is a, a particularly challenging move lift and lift come on drive those arms up if you're really tired just the even air taps here will do fine lift and lift you want to get a few in above your head before time is up well done excellent okay let's go back to a few jump ropes 
Now we've a double knee repeater next. Keep going there with your move. One and two and switch to the other side. So two on both sides. Keep breathing throughout now. Nice big deep breath in. Breathe it all out. Well done, double knee. Two on both sides. Come on, slam those arms down. Work those abs, just gently bring your rib cage down towards that moving leg. Two, good, other side. Two, that's it, one. Two, change sides. And two. Excellent work, that is brilliant. Okay, let's jump rope it again if you want, or go for a little jog, or just march it out. We have a step back for three, keep going there. Two, three, switch to the other side. Okay, three and three. Alternating legs next. Lots of steps here. Knees up. All right, let's go. One, two, and change sides. One, two, and three. Switch around. One, two, three. Good. Two, and three. One, two, and three. Come on, work those triceps. Push those arms right back for me. One, two, and three, keep going. Two, and three, and last one here. Excellent work. Okay, back to a little, little fast run, little jump rope. Okay, keep going there. I'm gonna step across the room, chest press. All right, step and chest. That's next. Okay. Keep going, very light on the feet here, even with my jump ropes. Turning that rope, getting some wrist movements here. Okay, let's go, step across. Now let's get the arms involved, upper body. Push out, pull back. Push out, pull back. Come on, we can do it. Really drive those palms forward and pull right back with those elbows, feeling strong here. That's it, good work. Let's make our way back over. Well done, okay. Walk it again. Catch your breath a little bit. Now with two knees, next move. And then step back, and you can get the triceps involved again after your run or little jog or walk there. I'll finish it out with you. Let's get ready now. Two knee raises, two step backs. Any second now. Okay. Now, knee. Knee, step, and step. Knee. Knee, step, and step. Tap out that knee. Don't lean back. Push the arms back with the legs going back. Keep the heel up. Heel stays up here. Just back on your toe. Two, lift and lift. One and two, lift and lift. One and two, well done. Okay, lovely, lovely work there. All right, we'll come back to walks, jogs, skips here, jump ropes. Next move, forward walk, back, side and side. And we actually might get a little, even a little punch out with those side steps. Okay, Let's get a little bit more jump roping with you. So forward walk, back walk, step out to the side, both legs. And if you want to add in that little punch, you can. Forward and back, punch and punch. Forward and back, side step, punch. That's it, good, come on. Nice and energetic. For two, forward and back and punch. That's it. And back. Keep going, come on. And back, one and two. Excellent job with that one. All right. 
Okay, let's walk it again. Now we have our last move, round one, and then we'll head back, right back to exercise one, back to the start. So we're gonna do a leg curl, punch up, punch down, up and down. Let's get a nice fast jump rope before we finish. Well done. Curl the leg, up, punch and down. Up and down, and down. Reach and down, up and down. Come on, we can do this. Up and down, and down. Really drive that heel up to your bottom, contract those hamstrings there, those, the back of your thighs, up and down. Well done. Feeling really good and stretched now. Okay. Now we're back to jump jacks. So we know what's coming up, so I'll get a, a lot more jump ropes in with you, a lot more marches and running. Okay, let's go over to the side now. Our jump jacks for two, or just two legs coming out. March or shuffle over, and other side. Okay, so one and two. March it over. If you're keeping it low impact, that's fine. You do your marches. Over we go. March across. One and two. If you're feeling nice and energetic, you can take up the pace. It's a lovely exercise, this one. I really like it. And one and two. Over we go. One and two. You can go right up over the head if you want to. Two. Well done. Okay, excellent. Right, we have that step touch move. We start on the right this time. I'll just show it to you again. You keep doing there your walks or your runs there. So one, two, three, and then knee comes up. You've got to count those three steps coming in with that right leg. Or we'll get in a little muddle, so we will. Okay, let's go with it. One and two, and three, and knee. Good, keep going. And two, and three, and draw that knee and do a little tummy crunch there. And two, and three, and knee. Good, we got the rhythm of it yet? It's a lovely fun exercise. And three, and knee. One, and two, and three, and knee. Left leg will be the lead after our little jump rope here, or your jogs or your walks. I love jump roping, it's great cardio. And you can keep it nice and light, you don't have to be slamming down on your joints. Just going gently from toe to toe here. That's it, good work. Get ready now for the left leg to lead. I think at this move it helps if you open the legs wide one and two and three right leg lift one and two and three and lift good come on we can do this and two and three and lift and repeat and two and three and squeeze it out one have fun with it and two add those arms and three, and you made it, well done. A little bit of a brain teaser, that one. Okay, I'm gonna do a steep incline walk for a change with this one. I like these moves, these huge, these giant knee raises. Just pretend you're climbing up some nice big steps. I've got a little jog coming next. Arms pumping up and down. That's it, good work. And lift, and lift. Well done. Little jog now. Right, up and down. Now you can march this if you want to. You don't have to be jogging it. And down. Up and down. Come on, get that energy coming all over the body, all throughout those muscles. Up and down. That's it, keep going. Nice strong punches. Just there now. Well done. Have a little walk if you need it. 
got those heel taps either tapping the heel keeping it light or making a nice big cardio exercise next arms over the head I'll take a look at your breath a little bit here keep going now big deep breaths in big breaths out that's it okay let's go with this one lift lift it up come on we can do it lift and lift forward and back if you want to get off the spot you can stay on the spot if you find it easier for the coordination come on we can do it last 10 seconds strong with those punches let's see that energy well done excellent job okay feeling good now that's it take it up into a little run if you want to we have our double knee repeater next can be nice and light so increasing that heart rate a little bit more increasing that breathing rate a little bit more bring those heels up a little closer to your calves keep your back straight well done okay ready for double knee and one and two Two, change over and two good work come on stay with it one and two switch for two it's a lovely fun exercise going from side to side and one and two and change for two one and two good work okay back to a little walk we can do a lateral walk here if you want to I like to move side to side as much as I can with our step backs for three and then changing to the other leg next. That's it, good work. So the next move is alternating, one leg to the other. Let's stay here and get ready for it. Let's go, get the triceps, two, three and switch. Three, one, two, and three. Good work. Two, and three. Two, and three. Two, and three. Come on, keep going. Feel the back of those arms working hard as you drive those palms back behind you. Last one. Good work. Excellent. Okay. Walking it out again. Come on, let's do a nice big exaggerated march. We're going to do another lateral move next. Step across the room with your chest press. Come on, keep going. You're doing great. Drive those elbows back. Okay, let's go. Step across the room. Let's work that chest. Push and pull back. Good work. Push and pull back. You should feel those posture muscles now kicking in. Most definitely round two, I can feel it. Last few seconds. Well done, great work. Okay, now let's walk it again. Brisk walk, come on. We've got our two knee raises next, two step backs, so we're introducing a little bit more triceps. Fast as you can. Pump those arms. That's it, come on, keep the body moving. Well done, that was great. Okay, knee, knee, step and step, knee knee good and nice big high knee raises keeping the back really flat back and back one two one two good one, two back and back one two back and back come on lift lift and back and lift and lift let's finish out the back 
Well done. Okay, we've got to get them all in. Okay, let's get a few jump ropes before we finish up. Good work. Come on, keep going. Getting lots and lots of steps now with these fast feet. That's good. That's what we want. Last few seconds. Okay, ready? Forward. Side punches now. And two. That's it. Good. Get those little side steps as well. One and two. Forward. And back. One and two. Good. And back. One and two, forward and back, punch, punch, that's it, and back, punch it out, well done, that's a lovely exercise, really enjoy it, okay, now here we go, last walk, last move, which is our leg curl, punching up and down, if you enjoyed today's workout, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button below the video, it was a nice energetic Sweaty walk indeed. Come on, let's get those last few jump ropes in. Nearly there. Excellent, okay. Curl the leg. Punch it up and down. Up and down, good work. Come on, we can do this. And down. Lift and down. Nearly there now. Punch it, down, reach, and down, and down, good work, up and down, you're doing great, last few seconds, and there you go, and there's my big clap for you for completing today's lovely, lovely walking workout, well done to everyone, okay, let's take that heart rate down a notch or two, just gentle little walk, just reduce your range of movement. Excellent, well done. Okay, let's take it into some stretches. So if you have a mat handy, always have your mat handy for your workouts or a towel or something soft that you can go on. And we'll just stretch out those hips. So going forward, feeling a nice stretch here in the front of the leg and up into the hip flexor. Feels good. Put your hands behind your head. I'm just going to turn to one side. Watch your back. Now, before you do anything twisting of the trunk, make sure your abdominals are very much engaged. You feel your tension building up, pulling the belly button in and towards your spine. That's it. Nice stretch here for your trunk. It's very mild. Push forward into the hip flexor stretch there. Good. Well done. Feels really nice. Put your hands down on the ground. Reach up. Feeling a nice stretch there on one side for your shoulders, your chest. And we'll do it the other side. Reaching up if you can. That feels quite challenging. Hold that there. Let's go up into plank. Hold your plank for a second or two. Try not to dip your hips. And then the other side, come up, stretch out that hip flexor, hold that for a few seconds, feels really nice, put your hands behind your head, just rotate slightly, keeping that core engagement for me, keeping that belly button pulled to your spine. So work on your balance a little bit here, feeling a little wobbly. Okay, hands down. Feels good there, reach up. And then the other side. Well done, back into your plank position. Again, hold it just for a few seconds. It's nice to practice your planks, great abdominal work. Nice for building the shoulders. Try not to dip your hips now or raise your butt cheek to the ceiling. Stay in that neutral spine. Gently drop to your knees. Sit back into a child pose position. Walk your fingertips away to stretch out those back muscles. Feels really nice. Getting a nice stretch for your toes, your feet here as well in your child pose. Okay. 
Okay, walk your hands in. Just gently sit down into that 90 degrees sit. So you have one foot behind you, the other foot forward. This is a lovely stretch for your lower half. It's great for your hip mobility and your hip health. Something that should be done every day of the week. You don't have to be exercising to do this. It's just a habit we need to get into. Maybe try and get off the chairs and head down to the floor. That feels really good. Just sitting here like this. It just looks so simple, so basic. Usually the most simple moves are the best. And then we just, just switch sides. Just take your time getting over to the other side. Pay attention to how your knees feel with this. I know some people might find it a little intense on the knee. That feels really nice. And put your hands down for support. You can wiggle around and find any nice little tight spots that you can work on. <laughs> They're always there. Well done. I'd like to say a big thank you for joining me today. You did a lovely walk. Lovely, lovely um, sweat was built up. And uh, Make sure you do hydrate now. Get your fluids back into you. And also, if you want a longer cool down, I'll link it up in the description box below the video. Thanks for joining me today. You did a lovely job and I'll see you in the next one. Have a lovely time. Bye bye.